chronic renal failure. Some of the most gratifying results I got as a Chinese herbalist in veterinary medicine came from treating chronic renal failure in the cat. If you're not used to using Chinese herbs and you want to feel good and you want to see how well the herbs work and you want physical proof that your herbal therapy worked, then I would highly suggest that you treat your chronic renal failure, feline, especially feline, your chronic feline renal failure patients with one of these two formulas. And I'll explain in a moment. Chronic renal failure patients do much better on a carnivore diet. They don't do well on restricted protein diets like KD because they end up breaking down their own protein to meet their body protein needs. When you restrict protein, they break down their own body tissues and then increase the nitrogenous waste by breaking down their own protein, body protein, and they actually make their uremia worse. And so I would suggest that chronic renal failure cats be fed a carnivore diet, and of course I do recommend subcutaneous fluid therapy depending on the elevations of BUN and or phosphorus, and I recommend Chinese, herbal, Chinese herbs. The two formula that you can use with good results are Lu Wei Di Huang Wan, which is Romania 6, and the other one is called Jin Kui Shen Qi Wan, which is a kidney chi tablet. Now first you have to define the conditions under which you're going to use each one of these herbal formulas. In early renal failure with mild to moderate elevations of BUN and creatinine, please give Lu Wei Di Huang Wan. Now, Lu Wei Di Huang Wan will nourish kidney yin and clear heat. And this is a very famous formula. It's been used for thousands of years. What I would say about Lu Wei Di Huang Wan is that it has a limited ability to clear deficient heat. But usually in early renal failure, many of these cats don't really have deficient heat, and so this formula is appropriate. So if the animal has a rapid, a rapid thready pulse with no coating to its tongue, and remember, most cats don't have a coating to their tongue. If it has a rapid thready pulse, that's more indicative of heat. If the pulse is more normal, Luwei Di Huang Wan is still going to work really well for you. If there's more yin deficient heat, there's other formulas we can use. But for right now, if you have an animal that comes in and its tongue is a little red, its pulse is a little thin and thready, go ahead and choose Lu Wei Di Huang Wan in order to treat the cat. Jin Kui Shen Qi Wan is a formula which is more warming. Jin Kui Shen Qi Wan has all of the same herbs as Lu Wei Di Huang Wan, except for the two in red. And if you notice the two in red, the two in red are the ones that warm and tonify kidney yang. So you see it says Gui Zi right here, Gui Zi and Fu Zi, okay? They are ones that will warm. If you look, Lu Wei Di Huang Wan, and you add the two herbs Gui Zi and Fu Zi to warm and tonify kidney qi yang. This is more for cats that have more moderate to severe renal disease. And these animals are going to have tongues that can be more pale, that can be a little bit more lavender in appearance. These are animals that are typically much older and have had a progression of their chronic renal failure. And I would say that these two formulas can be used to treat the vast majority of chronic renal failure in cats. And these animals can live for a very, very long time with a renal failure for years and years not just a few months, especially when the, these formulas are combined with an appropriate diet and subcutaneous fluid administration. So Lu Wei Di Huang Wan nourishes kidney yin and mi mildly clears heat. This is for mild, mild to moderate renal disease, early renal disease in the cat. Jin Kui Shen Qi Wan is used for more moderate to severe. And one of the ways that you can also look at this is that the, when the cat has much more isocenuria or its urine is becoming quite dilute, Jin Kui Shen Qi Wan is going to be a more appropriate formula to use. And again, try to look at the tongue and pulse to determine whether or not you need a formula that's going to nourish kidney yin and clear a little bit of deficient heat, or you're going to need a formula that's going to warm and tonify kidney qi yang. Bazen Tong 
Bosentong is the formula that can be used to treat the anemia secondary to renal disease that develops. Another way to tell which one of the formulas to use, we use Jinkui Shenqi one, we use this formula, typically in combination with this formula, because when you start seeing anemia developing secondary to renal disease, that means that your, the renal disease is becoming much worse because there's a decline in erythropoietin and the marrow, bone marrow is not producing enough red blood cells. And so when you see anemia secondary to renal disease and another parameter is you see elevations of phosphorus, this is the formula that you should be using. This formula, typically, there's no anemia. There's no increase in phosphorus. The urine can be, is, is much more concentrated than when you need to use this formula to warm and tonify kidney qi yang. And bazantang is a qi uh, blood tonic, very commonly used uh, for animals that have anemia of renal disease. Very good.